That's one carrier down. Great start. Let's regroup with our bombers. Finally. Somewhere classified. Just sent you the coordinates. Got him. Punching them in now. Jumping to hyperspace in three, two, one. Punch it. Oh. Uh, what? The hyperdrive failed again. No.
Finally, jeez. This is where the boss keeps his secret project. Who'd want to get this close to the Ringali Nebula? I believe that is the idea. General Sindula. Hello, Vanguard. Welcome to the Nadiri Dockyards. I'd give you a tour, but the Empire knows we're up to something now. They'll be looking for us, which means we have work to do. Boom, 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 boom. Raider record. Nope. Not even close. Nope. Still no efficiency. ISD Overseer. An old enemy has finally surfaced. One of my spies has linked the attacks on our Star Destroyers with the New Republic Starhawk project. A common factor is Lyndon James. You knew James better than anyone, Captain Carroll. If I had... I'd have destroyed him before he betrayed us at Fostar Haven. Then this is your second chance. The rebels are keeping a low profile. Take Titan Squadron, hunt down this star, and eliminate it. Gladly, Admiral Sloane. But if I may ask, there's a particular pilot I'd like to requisition. Ah, the Big Grizz. Copy, 
your soul. Captain Carroll's bringing someone in to hunt. The treacherous slime taking our ships. Good. More the merrier. <laughs> Easy, Von Reg. Remember the last time you lost your call? The day I cut through a whole squadron of rebels and saved your neck. <laughs> Shen's right. Tighten it up, Sol. And Von Rick, save a little for the enemy. Overseer to Titan, finish your inspection. Your new wingmate has arrived. So, you're our new wingmate. Welcome to Titan Squadron. You're I'm short. Gray, squadron leader. I think they're waiting for you in the briefing room. Better make a good first impression. Here, let me just take my pants off. I'll make a big impression. Welcome home, pilot. It feels like a lifetime since Fostar Haven doesn't it? One fool betrays his squadron, and loyal officers like us are reassigned in disgrace. I heard they sent you to the Outer Rim. I got the Merim Scepter, protecting fuel shipments from petty scoundrels and pirates. The kind of posting that used to end careers before Endor, before Lyndon Jabes reappeared. No doubt you've heard. Admiral Sloan has instructed me to hunt that traitor down and end this Project Starhawk. It seemed fitting that I bring you back to help me destroy Linden. Your Empire needs you, pilot. Good. Are you willing? Yes. Good. For now, you will be flying as Titan III. Let's get to work. Titan three. Oh, these guys are all short. Except for that guy, he's got a big ass head. Are we ready? One of our spies, Agent Thorne, has discovered vital intelligence on Project Starhawk. Your mission is to extract her from an orbital outpost above Hosni and Prime. Your job is to secure the outpost for our extraction team who will arrive aboard the shuttle Bladius. Behind enemy lines, you must be precise and swift. We have no room for error, Titan. To gain access, you'll have to eliminate perimeter defenses. Intelligence reports missile platforms defending Hosnian space. Destroy them. The outpost itself is protected by turbo laser cannons on all sides. Evade and eliminate them all. When you've secured the area, you will escort the Gladius to the outpost, and our extraction team will acquire Agent Thorn. Once Thorn is secure, Reach your Gozanti cruisers and return to the Overseer. Do not lose our spy under any circumstances. That is all. All right, Soul. I'm Rella Soul. Mm. No need to introduce yourself. I've already reviewed your service record. It's been a long time since you were on the front lines. In days past, a mission like ours would have been afforded every possible resource. Unfortunately, times are tight since Endor. In one battle, we lost our Emperor and gained a hundred warring factions. If only Emperor Palpatine hadn't dissolved the Imperial Senate. At least then, Senators, like my parents, could have maintained order after Endor. But no. Not that I question the Emperor's decision, of course. But now that he's gone, we must look to the future. And reinstating the Senate would help subdue all of this infighting. We can talk later, perhaps. <laughs> perhaps not. Now more than ever, the Empire needs reliable soldiers like Agent Thorne. Like you. Unity is the only path to progress. I trust you are aligned with Admiral Sloan's vision for the Empire. We cannot afford to fracture. 
Not after Endor. This mission is a vital step towards dismantling the Rebellion. And they are a Rebellion. Don't be fooled by their new name. The New Republic will fall, just like the last one. It's time for you to play your part. Get to the hangar. Ready your ship. You'll be the new pilot. Sergeant Wade, chief mechanic and head of the hangar crew. Don't see the appeal in flying myself, but I've been working on Ty since they rolled off the assembly line. Your fight is in good hands. The Overseer saw some action at Pothor and Jo, but it's had a complete inspection and overhaul for this mission, Admiral Sloan's orders. And on my orders, every tie in this hangar has been serviced and test flown. Tighten half the rivets myself. We're ready. Gotta say, I don't know how you and Titan cope out there. No shields or life support, just whole plating between you and space. It must build character. Never met a TIE pilot who backed down from any challenge, shields or not. I've prepared your starfighter to match the latest Imperial guidelines. But if you've got a preferred component or need something customized, I'll take care of it. Just say the word. Your TIE fighter's ready. Good flying. You're the new arrival. I'm Havina Vonreg. Titan can always use another pilot, so long as you're good at killing rebels. We're going right into their territory, Hosnian Prime. We'll give those scum just a taste of what it was like at Endor. I was there, you know, when the rebellion murdered our Emperor. <coughs> Half my squad died trying to defend him. Captain Carroll understands. She doesn't lecture me about justifiable force like my other commanders. She knows all I need is a target. <laughs> Politics are for admirals. I keep it simple. Always shoot to kill. Mess with the squadron and you mess with me. But do your job and I'll have your back. Later. Mm. Later in my bunk. Yeah, yeah. Newcomer, welcome to Titan. Call me Shen. Before you ask, helmet stays on, cockpit or not. Too many hard landings, broken neck, five, six times. Cybernetics keep me going. Fight, fall, get up, fight again. All for the Empire. Advice. <coughs> Don't annoy Von Rack. Good talk. Another time. All right, helmet. The tight fighter. Classical. Maneuverable. Flexible. Can't take much direct fire, but that's no problem for a skilled pilot.